Okay, my name is Ned Horvath, and uh, uh, this is about, I'm going to try to say, give you five ideas in five minutes. They're going to save you 500 hours this year. If you take on any of them, swallow it, is that better? Okay. So, where do I come from? I actually work here at the uh, university. My background, mandatory background slide, I'm a recovering manager, uh, recovering professor, recovering a lot of things, but I started, I'm ending my, my career the way I began it as a DevOps person. Actually, I started as a developer. The ops came later. So this is about people engineering. First thing you got to learn, the zero thing you got to learn is what's important and what's urgent. If you don't know what you're doing that's important and what you're doing is urgent and what the difference is, you're screwed. There's no way you can manage the interruptions. There's no way you can manage any of your work. So method number one is somebody take point. If you're on a team of more than one person, you say, this week, I'm going to be the interrupt driven guy. Everybody else, it's your turn next week, it's your turn the week after that, and we go in rotation like that, and everybody else gets to be in flow. They get to be solving those important problems, urgent or not. So what are you going to be doing with that? Everybody else has their notifications turned off. How nice. This isn't just the junior people that are doing it. Everyone else is available for things that are urgent and important, and maybe swarm on those. So you're not just during in flow, you've got to be able to respond. You reply to everything because customers, that's why we're here. So we always tell them, and if you're bored, you can work on that self-service stuff. Because the stuff that's unimportant, we got a new word for that, toil. Work on reducing that and get rid of it. Okay. Idea number two, train a screener. And the way you do this, you look for somebody who's uh, bored and bright and ambitious. And you have to get permission for this one. But the, typically, somebody who's like that, their manager thinks they're a pain in the ass anyway. They're more than happy to give you some of their time. So go ahead and grab that. And what you're going to do is take them through three phases. First, you're going to pair screen things for importance and urgency. Then they're going to graduate to where they're going to screen it on their own and get your approval. Time box that, 10 minutes per interrupt, that's it. They come to you with for promotion. And then you, and in the third phase, they just do it. For extra credit, they handle the toil stuff. For extra, extra credit, you train them to join your team. And that really spreads the work. Number thir three idea, office hours. Everybody has notifications turned off, but you got to have some time when you actually come back and address the problems. Your time may vary. I said a half hour before lunch and a half an hour before quitting time. You may adjust that in your organization, whatever works for your time frames. But everybody's got notifications turned off, and you do, in fact, have to come through and deal with stuff during those times. So you're always available. Some refinement on that, which is that if somebody needs to get you when office hours are not in place, they have to bring you a beer chit. But if you're not present at your desk during office hours, that's a negative beer chit. You'd be amazed how fast those will pile up once your tier one people have figured out you're not at your desk. So be ready for that. Number four, the square jar. Quick ideas, quick, pro quick questions are 50 bucks. Interesting, interesting ideas are free. If you remember where I got the 50 bucks, take your salary, divide that by 2,000. I think you can all do that math in your head. If that's more than 50 bucks and you're hiring, let me know. Um, <laughs> but the idea here is that half an hour, they, that, that's a half an hour cost. Your loaded cost is about 50 bucks every half hour. Okay, and somebody who says it's a quick question, they're not taking responsibility for the fact that they cost that half hour. So just to remind you, only work what's important. Take, take turns taking point, train a screener, get some office hours, and get that swear jar. <laughs>